What's going on guys? It's your boy Adjen back again for another other playing video and for today it's time for Akari's Arena debut. Yes, I'm gonna be debuting Akari in Arena right now and I'm not really positive about this one. <laughs> Why? Because in our server, uh, there are a lot of really really good players, especially in the high tier arena rankings. Uh, most of them are probably equipped with uh, immunity set and that is the main counter to Akari. So I'm gonna be fighting uh, Lee Pale Fire. I'm not gonna be fighting Nile because uh, this one has a really nice speed. I cannot outspeed this one because once you get outsped by this one, it's already over. Uh, this one, I still have a chance for this one. I forgot the speed of uh, Lee Pale Fire. But let us try to outspeed this one. Uh, the thing that I will be using for this one is something like this. And does not matter this one. Uh, I'm gonna be using Akari with Diaste, no, <coughs> excuse me, Notia, and Mayne. Mayne for the speed imprint. Uh, Akari is the main opener. In the hopes that I will be able to debuff these characters. Uh, Diaste, because Diaste is a really nice uh, character to have. And then Notia works pretty well with Akari if Akari can land the debuffs. So this is my Akari stats. I just gave her my uh, Valentine's uh, gear. So I have here a 318 speed. Uh, nothing really much with the others. Uh, the skill 2, 2 max, max 2. I max the skill 2 and skill 3 because these are her bread and butter, especially the skill 3. So yeah, let us uh, go ahead and try Akari in Arena right now. I just hope that I can outspeed uh, this this enemy. If if not, I'm screwed. Uh, it turns out that I I can outspeed them. Uh, the good thing about Akari S3 is that uh, this one cannot trigger counter attack, cannot trigger the revenge from uh, this Stella, and cannot also trigger the agile response for something like Kyo or uh, Lila, which is pretty darn OP in my answer. If you can land this one. But as you can see, uh, oh, there's no immunity. This is uh, what is this? Anyways, let us uh, use this one. The animations for Akari's S3 is really, really nice. So I got the unbuffable there. Okay, one is dead. Wait, did the this Stella just use, just use revenge? I did not see. I did not see. I'm screwed. Like what the fuck? I'm screwed. How 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 did did this Stella attacks? Right? It should not be a. Uh, Oh, I get it now. From uh, Notia, Notia's debuff. So Notia's debuff triggers Distella's revenge. So Akari will not trigger Distella's revenge, but sadly, uh, Notia was able to trigger uh, Distella's uh, revenge. Mm, it makes sense. Okay. You also need some, uh, what do you call this? Uh, some accuracy, also some effectiveness to land the debuffs. Uh, is there anyone I can fight here? I'm not gonna be able to outspeed Koshira because Koshira has a uh, max speed on, on his characters. That is why I told you guys I'm not really positive in this showcase because most of my enemies here in our server are all pretty darn good ah this one against leo probably will work pretty well because uh oh she will also activate the from notia from notia's debuff uh she might be able to activate but 
And then Leo has immunity. As you can see, this is the worst enemy for Akari. Uh, the immunity set. Leo has immunity. Lila has immunity. It's GG. I'm dead. Uh, see? Uh, this Tela's Revenge will still be activated even if you combo Akari with Notia. So, if you're someone who's using that kind of combination, uh, I don't think it's uh, a really, really nice thing to do. Because uh, it will still trigger uh, this Tela's Revenge. And let's just use this one because uh, I'm gonna be dead. Might as well uh, kill uh, one character. Okay. Uh, let's use this one. Uh, this is the thing that I hate about fighting against Leo. Uh, it's the invulnerability buff. Uh, what is this? That one, the debuffs from Akari still needs some uh, effectiveness for it to land, uh, which is uh, really, really, really not that good. And I'm dead. What the fuck? You see, you you see now, guys, the weakness of Akari. That is why in my uh, first impressions video about her yesterday, I said that she is Copium OP. She's only good against uh, probably low tier arena, but in high tier, in high ranking tier in arena, she will not do that well. She will not do that well. And the counter attack still goes on and on. Come on. And I got taunted. Like, what? Fuck this Leo. Fuck this Leo. Die. can still win can still win this one this one is still winnable this one is still winnable as long as uh, I can uh, activate my revive then this one is still winnable uh, I still need to stall uh, two more turns okay it's possible Okay, there you go. We have some revive now. Uh, the damage of uh, Akari skill is also pretty weak. It's pretty weak. Like what? She is not meant for a DPS character. Probably her multipliers are very, very low. Probably the same like a uh, Valentine. This is already uh, a win for me. This is already a win for me. Yes. I still win this one simply because Mayne and Dia stay carries the, this fight. But. If we are talking about Akari as an opener, arena opener, she's not really that good in high tier arena. It probably she's going to be best used against low tier arena, but here in Diamond, Diamond 1 already here in our server, it's already not looking that good. Uh, let us try to fight this one, Lux. 
I don't think I can outspend Lux, but we will see. I already forgot the... Because I'm not really fighting... Uh, I mean, uh, I'm not really... I don't really remember the speed of this one. It's been a while since I bought Lux. Uh, we can probably wipe out uh, Tamara here with my Notia. Yes. Uh, against these type of teams, yeah, it's pretty good. But if you are fighting against someone with immunity, then yeah, I'm also dead. Like what? They're also dead. But Nay Nay will revive. Then I'm dead again. Nay Nay will revive. And this is the problem here. This is the problem here. I cannot uh, do something about this one. Fuck. Fuck me, dude. They should have uh, att attacked me first. I already lost the fight. Uh, if this one procs on me, Mane or the Aste, I'm screwed. Yeah, I'm screwed. I'm dead. See? No! Pretty much dead. Well, I think that's all I, I can showcase uh, Akari. As you can see, Akari is not looking pretty well. She's not really that uh, good, especially in high tier PvP. Probably in Platinum, uh, she will do work, do well. Because in Platinum, that is uh, somewhat mid tier to low tier uh, pvp but in high tier pvp no she's not doing pretty well probably in pve but who cares about pve you can just keep ticket the stages in pve you, you guys might be wondering uh, why you skip ticket if you can just pull auto because i'm lazy and i don't run out of skip tickets uh, let me show you my skip tickets how many? I still have 216. And I, I always run out of uh, pre stamina to use them. So yeah, I don't... Akari looks good design-wise. But in terms of performance in high tier PvP, she's not looking good. Well, let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. And I think that's it for me for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave a like and subscribe. I would really appreciate it if you could help me grow my channel more. And thank you to everyone who are supporting my channel. I appreciate every one of you. Until next time, peace.